sash about my left wrist and thread the end to the metal bars at the head of my bed. He pulls it tight so my left arm is flexed above me. He then secures my right hand. Tighten the sash tightly. <laughs> when I'm tied, I'm staring at him. He's visibly relaxed. He likes me tethered. I can't touch him this way. It occurs to me that none of his sons would have ever touched him either. And what's more, he would never have had the opportunity to. He would have always been in control of the distance. That's why he likes his rules. He climbs on top of me. He climbs off me and bends me. And what the fuck? Oh, okay, sorry. <laughs> this wreck is my hair got in the way. He climbs off me and bends to give me a quick peck on the lips. He then stands and lifts his shirt over his head. He undoes his jeans and drops to the floor. He is gloriously naked! Gloriously! <laughs> I'm going to pass that along to this fellow here. Dirk Suke. My inner goddess is doing a triple actual dismount of the uneven bars. <laughs> and abruptly, my mouth is dry. You have a mystique, dark drawn on classical lines, broad muscular shoulders, narrow hips, the inverted triangle. He obviously Works out. <laughs> mm. I could look up at him all day. He moves to the end of the bed and grabs my ankles, pulling them swiftly, swiftly and sharply downward so that my arms are stretched out and unable to move. Yeah. Oh my. <laughs> <laughs> That's better, he mutters, picking up a pint of ice cream. He climbs smoothly into the bed to struggle me once more. Very slowly, he peels off the lid and dips the spoon. <laughs> oh my. Oh my. Okay, let's try us a little bit as goofy. <laughs> It's still quite hard.